All I know is that he shot dead, and now he's gone. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. It's my power, not yours. Get that gun away from me, psycho! You know it's always you and me and I know. One in four people in the world suffer from mental ill health and half of the world's population are gamers. So what a fantastic platform in gaming to try to explain the ins and outs of mental, mental ill health. So it's really a long time to make just one game. For me, it means a lot when we can put some of ourselves in the game, talk about subjects that are really important for us. And of course, if the players are liking the game or just reacting to those subjects, talking about it, it's, it means really a lot to me. I think, like you say, showing uh, the diversity about uh, uh, culture, uh, sexuality, uh, um, point of interest of uh, showing that the world is really di diverse and all the characters from our society are too. It's, it's to be realistic, so it's also to, to, to create all those characters to show the diversity of the of our world, so yeah. I'd be very surprised if someone could play all of Life is Strange games and not find a single person in there that they're like, that reminds me a little bit of my mum or that reminds me of a friend I had at school. And I think it's interesting because they are very good at not drawing like a hard line between right and wrong and good and bad. So I think it really helps encourage empathy and discussion and I really appreciate how the games do that. It's not just a game for the sake of entertainment only, but it's a game that actually has a message to give out, has some meaning, has um, a valuable lesson in the end. And these type of games are the ones that, you know, will teach the audience something and will make them see something from a dis different perspective that they didn't necessarily saw before. And that is what, you know, changes people and changes the world. I guess uh, in Life is Strange too. I think it's just how, how uncompromising it is in terms of its story so that it's not afraid to make you feel uncomfortable to get the message across that these issues are happening in the real world and that's why I think it has such an impact. Life is Strange 2 covers all sorts of topics I mean from humanity to racism discrimination and it's it's important to talk about because these things are not all right racism is definitely not all right and uh, I wish we could live in a world where none of this happened. I think players have been moved by the subjects we talk about. And again, I think talking about those subjects is really important as creators. If you talk about a teenager in high school, you, you have to talk about that. I would just want to thank um, the players for, for playing the game and for just giving a chance, giving a shot to the characters and discovering their journey and their story and somehow making it their own stories. And just, yeah, just thank you for for playing and 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 living the journey of those characters. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all of their support. Um, it's been an incredible journey throughout these past two and a half years, and I'm incredibly grateful for all of you, all of the love and support that they show. And um, I hope that you enjoyed the game so far, and you enjoy what's coming up next.